So we're here picking up our 100-day horse for the Cowboy Poetry Festival in Heaver. And what I'm noticing here about these wild horses is that it takes a hell of a lot of equipment to manage these horses. These are solid steel panels. They're six feet tall. There's round pens and crells all over the place. They got this big squeeze chute here to hold this boy in here while we work on him. And I don't know, this squeeze chute's got to be a $25,000 piece of equipment. I'm taking him home in a $50 halter. See how this goes. Well, I'm going to be honest with you. Once we got this guy in the chute, I was really thinking I might have uh, overhorsed myself here. This guy's a five-year-old gelding. Hadn't been touched in five years. That's almost the end of their uh, lifespan here at the facilities. This is his last chance to get out of here and to get to a good home because once they make it past five, they don't get adopted out. Let's get this guy back to the ranch, see what we can get going. I want to introduce you to my friend uh, Grizz right here. He's a five-year-old Mustang from Wyoming. He's my Mustang for the 2014 Cowboy Poetry Festival in Heber City, Utah. It's a 100-day challenge, so I picked this horse up one week ago. Me and about 10 other trainers have got a week to work, or a, we've got 100 days to work with our horses. I've had this one just one week. I just put the first ride on him. I didn't have any video for that, but I want to grab a quick little bit of video for the second ride. I want it to be as great as the first ride, so otherwise that's why we're having the video. But this guy's a real sweetheart. He wants to figure this out. He's had a pretty good week already. We've done some great groundwork. We've got through some ugly stuff. And uh, it's time for him to start being a horse and really enjoying it. So here's ride number two. First one was about 20 minutes ago.
I like that. Now last year I got my whole face smashed in on the bucking horse, so I've really worked hard in the last year to eliminate the bucking part of working with horses. Come a long ways. This is the type of ride that I want to have on the second ride and on the first ride. Nice, calm, quiet. I want them 100% confident in what they're doing. This guy's getting there. He didn't have much reaction at all to that, so can't wait to see what another 93 days will do with this guy. See you guys in Heber. Somebody's going to get him an awesome horse right here. If you think it's yours, start talking to me now. Let's work out a deal. Five-year-old gelding from Wyoming. Awesome horse. See you on the next video.